Welcome to the American Dream. I'm your host, Chris Kaiser, and this is the Mermaid City, Norfolk, Virginia. So in the spirit of all this naval history, today we're gonna to visit the Nauticus Museum and the Battleship Wisconsin. So come on, let's go inside. We're here today with Ren West, Director of Development and Marketing at Nauticus. Ren, could you tell us a little bit about Nauticus and the Nauticus Foundation? Yeah, so Nauticus is a maritime discovery center. We're located in downtown Norfolk, right along the Elizabeth River. Um, we have a main museum, which focuses on telling the stories of the maritime environment, the maritime industry, and the military. We use um, several assets to do that, which include the battleship Wisconsin, which is the largest and last battleship built by the U.S. Navy, as well as our amazing sailing program, where we take students and adults out to sail and explore the Elizabeth River. And last but not least, we're home to Virginia Virginia's only cruise terminal. We serve the community um, with different programs and education and lots of great things. Thank you Thank for you. joining me today and I look forward to seeing you soon. And if you want to learn to sail, Nauticus is the place to come. I'm here with Sarah Linden Brooks, who's the director of Sail Nauticus. Sarah, tell us a little bit about the program. So Sail Nauticus is located right here on the Nauticus campus. It is a community sailing center that is focused on getting individuals out on the water. We run an after-school program for Norfolk Public School middle school students that focuses on leadership, STEM development, and uh, citizenship. And it's a wonderful program right here on our Harbor 20s. Incorporated in 1705, Norfolk has a storied history dating back to the 16th century. We can't overlook the huge naval presence here. Norfolk is home to the world's largest naval station, supporting the largest concentration of U.S. naval forces anywhere. We're standing here on the decks of the battleship Wisconsin BB-64, and I'm here with Keith Nitka, who's the battleship operations manager. Keith, can you tell us a little bit about this historic vessel? Absolutely, thank you, Chris. Thanks for being here this morning. Thank you. So Battleship Wisconsin is the last battleship built by the United States Navy, uh, starting with number one, BB, BB-1, uh, finishing with BB-64. Uh, Wisconsin is one of the four Iowa-class battleships, the, uh, the last battleships put to sea by the United States Navy, the largest ships uh, that, were in the, that were in the world at the time in the 1940s. Battleship Wisconsin turns 80 years old next April. Uh, but in those 80 years, she saw 14 years of service to this great nation. And in those 14 years were three wars, World War II, the Korean conflict, and then Desert Shield, Desert Storm. And I was a crew member on board during Desert Storm. Oh, oh. Thank you for your service. Thank you very much for your support, sir. Hey Lauren, how are you? I'm good. Welcome to 552 Mowbray. Oh, thank you. It's nice to meet you. Isn't it lovely? Look at the barrel soup. Oh, it's amazing. It's just absolutely incredible. Well, walking you through this 1910 home, where you have about 6,500 square feet. Wow. You have a living room on your right, a morning room on your left. Okay. Okay, there are four working fireplaces in the houses. That has one, this has one, and two sets of stairs. Okay. Okay, you've got the stairs for cool. your Houses guests. built in 1910. I had two sets of stairs. <laughs> you got it. One for the, the fans folks and one for us commoners. This is a fitting place for us to end our tour in this mahogany laden library. That's uh, beautiful. Chris, it's been such a pleasure working with you. Thank you for showing me this amazing home, Lauren, and I look forward to working with you in the future. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for joining me today as we explored some of the history of this amazing city. Please join me next time in Norfolk, and here's to your American dream. Okay.